Hi, Alfie Travelers! We're here in Gangwa and we're leaving Gangwa now and we're going back to Seoul. So come with us and enjoy the trip! We're all set up and we're ready to leave Gangwa and we're turning back to Seoul. Give you a snippet of how we take the transportation through buses by Gangwa, the farmville of South Korea. We are right here at a bus stop. The buses here runs about it depends on the time, sometimes longer, sometimes shorter than usual. That's how it is in the provinces. In Gangwa, all you see is the farmland and all the greenhouses. It's mostly mountainous, the trees are just all around. So we can take the train station called Gure Station. Let's go! This is the Gure Station. Every train is so nice. Wow. I'm transferring to another line it's called uh, line number 9. It's a brown line. It's bound to BHS Medical Center. The signs here and numbers are very a breeze and visible. So you don't have to panic when you're transferring uh, train stations. I would, you know, if you're getting on and the Finn Express train or all stop. You can see the green icon. Green icon means all stop and also depends on the music of that train coming. If it's red icon, it means all stop or express train. You hear it? That's the sound of all express train. It's mellifluous. We're going to have lunch. My favorite kimbap place. I recommend that place to you. They have a good kimbap there. There it is! Kimbap place! So for 8k1, we already have a free bonchan, shoe small, and a good bibimbap. It's an okay. evening Saturday. Yeah, so we're back in Seoul. So we're, we lived. So again, this is a compound. So this is an MK guest house where we lived here in Seoul. So after a few days, we transferred to another Airbnb. Oh, it's full! Oh my god! We have CCTVs on both sides of the buses and even on overhead of the buses they have like 360 camera above. They have a Pokeball for tonight. So I love this. This is my jam. 24 hours later. Travelers are here in Pimac House. It's a pizza place. We ordered a good one, like two flavors. It has pepperoni minus Hawaiian pizza. Hello fit travelers! Welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, please don't forget to like and subscribe. And to my regular uh, viewers, hello, welcome back again. Time check, it's 2 p.m. and it's 9 degrees Celsius. Today, I'm heading to the Diamond Place where my fiancé purchased the engagement ring. And I'm going to pick up the wedding band because right now it's working. In order to get there, you need to set an appointment. Let's go to Sango Station. One thing I like about uh, train stations here or subways here in South Korea, even you get on a wrong train, just get an escalator and move to the other platform. My wedding band! I tried to get in the gate, so it's the card says error. So I panicked a little bit to ask the help from the information. And it says it was out of balance because um, reloading machines here are mostly only accepting cash, not debit or credit cards. <laughs> is coming. Okay, so, so we pass by the Song City University. So these are mostly students who are coming out from there. Look at this cheeseburger. Mm. The copycat of In and Out in the United States here. Mm. I learned something from him. <laughs> An MRS degree <laughs> for being an exchange student. It's a sarcasm joke. 
fact about Roger, he is obsessed with spoons. He likes it. <laughs> so if you have this one, you better hide it. <laughs> Hello, travelers! And today is Tuesday and we're moving to another apartment around Incheon area. And we are here in Noryangjin, as you can see in my previous vlog. We're just going to carry a huge bag because the big red bag, my suitcase, is full of pasalubong from Daiso. So we send it out. It's a big bag, <laughs> like coming from the province in the Philippines. Uh -huh. The sound of the All Express train. <laughs> So this place costs 30,000 pesos per month. So I'll give you a room tour. The toilet. Wow, nice toilet. And we have so many towels. <laughs> they like giving small towels. Hi! And of course, washer. Small kitchen. And Jeff fridge. Do you have a coffee maker and a kettle? Ah, uh, and the ocean view. There's a porch with a beautiful ocean view. Mm -hmm. Did you hear that? I got more stuff. <laughs> and do you know what is my favorite appliance? Washer! You know what? In South Korea, they have odd and even elevators. Our floor is even number. It's dinner time! <laughs> Ooh, that was a good food. We are here we are currently at the airport for now to pick up the big red. It was delivered right here in this place. And we finally found the big red. Sure, mama. Good morning, coffee time. Did you know that water here in South Korea is potable? There's no radiant heat here on the seat. The seat is cold. Of course, we are in a new place. First thing to do again is to find a good gym and grocery. This place is nice to stay. It's clean, it's wide, it's big. It's like the outskirts of Makati in the Philippines. But of course, it's much better. Okay, found a good one. Gangster gym. I like this better because it's spacious. like yakitori and yakimiku I'm trying this dessert there's bread let's try this bread that we bought Tastes so good. It's so good. Thursday, travelers, and nice to see you again on my daily life vlog. 
and today is my first day on the gym here in um, Yongdongpo, Incheon. The walking distance is 34 minutes uh? and that would be my warm-up. So I will use this walk as a warm-up. Let's walk with me! It's nice to walk outside because it's cold and you know, it's quiet. So my gym is over there, you see those buildings? They have a small park here, a children's playground and you know, there are some equipments too. Like a public gym. Waiting for the green light. That's my gym, gangster gym. Seventh floor. Yeah, this is female locker room. I've been watching a lot of TikToks about Koreans as being racist. Let me tell you this. Me as a Filipina living here in Korea for more than months, I haven't experienced even seeing the racism here. They've been treating me and my fiancé nicely. Sometimes you really have to immerse yourself with experience with the culture before you judge someone. That doesn't mean one opinion means you have to generalize everyone. Take note of that. There's Lee Min Ho in the bus waiting area. Just kidding. This place is very spacious and wide. Yeah. Everything's mm -hmm. new. Mm -hmm. Even the paint is new.